Best practice is profiles should be for a, a team that needs the same amount of access, uh, same amount of permissions uh, into Salesforce. A profile, if you think, is a profile of a team. Now permission sets is you're able to dive in and let's say, for example, you have a sales team of 10 individuals. They all need the exact same access, the exact same permissions, but let's say that maybe you have a, a lead sales team member that needs additional permissions. Let's say that your sales team is not able to transfer records, but you want the sales team leader or the lead of that team to transfer records. You don't want to open that up on the profile level, but you do want to open that up to that individual. So you would do that by doing a permission set. So let's jump in and just show quickly how that would be done. Uh, so under the profile, uh, let's jump into that sales profile, for example. Um, so on the sales profile, um, I, I really like uh, how you're able to just search here. Um, I'm gonna look at transfer uh, leads or even transfer record. Transfer record is, is much more uh, all encompassing. So you see here that they're not able to transfer or change the owner of most records. And this is that sales profile. But I want one user to be able to transfer records. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually create a permission set and I'm gonna give just that setting the ability to transfer records to that user. So here I can go uh, transfer record. Uh, don't need to put it on any license. And then I'm gonna go ahead and just put it straight in here. So I'm gonna go uh, under this transfer uh, record Let's go ahead and find that. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and edit here under the uh, system permissions. And I'm gonna give this permission set the ability to transfer records. So here I am, transfer record. Great, that's enabled. I'm gonna hit save. And then I can go ahead and assign this permission to that sales team lead. So they have the exact same permissions as the rest of the sales team. But now with a permission set, I've given just that individual the ability to do transfer records. It's not recommended that you create a whole new profile with this tacked on permission of transfer records, but rather you do it through a permission set. Um, if there's several of those, you know, you can get into per permission set groups, etc. But that's a great example of permissions, or sorry, profiles versus permission sets. You know, permission set is giving a permission to one or two individuals, but not all of the users under that profile. So again, this gives you better control over what users are able to do within the system via profiles and permission sets.